It is the 50th anniversary of Title IX, championed by Hawaii Zone, Patsy Mink. Mink changed the game for women in education. Cheyenne Sibley has a look at some of the events held today in her honor. Fifty years ago, Hawaii's Patsy Mink changed equality for women on a national level. Today, she was recognized with a ceremony in Washington, D.C., where congressional leaders and Mink's daughter spoke. This portrait will hang forever in the halls of the U.S. Capitol. My mother did not do her work to be honored for it. She did it because she thought it was right. The impact of her fight for equality continues to be felt by women everywhere. But look how far Wahina Athletics has come, and look at all the leaders coming out of that program. I wouldn't have gotten a UH athletic scholarship. I wouldn't have been able to become a lawyer. I wouldn't have been able to become a judge. So I thank Patsy Mink every day. Every chance I get, I speak about her and Title IX. They also spoke about how Title IX doesn't just affect women's equality in sports, but also equal safety and access to education for all. It's pretty amazing to think about how broad and expansive the scope of Title IX has become just based on the 37 words that Patsy and the authors wrote to have impacted all of us in education. We asked what Title IX means for the future of women in education. I think there will be a recommitment today and moving forward from institutions of higher education and K-12 through to ensure that students know their rights and are able to have a safe and fair and equitable process to be able to access their education if they feel like they are being discriminated against. Cheyenne Sibley, KHON 2 News, working for Hawaii.